Alright, yo, welcome back to another episode of my Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke. Uh, yeah, no guest star today. Well, let's get right into it. We got some dudes here at the battle place. Eugene, I think you're a little awkward, but you're very earnest. If I team up with my date, it could be an interesting combination. I think we could battle in an intriguing manner, do you? Sure. So yeah, last time, uh, we finished off that one route, 214, I think. And yeah, now we're here at the restaurant and all I can say is it's classier than McDonald's because for some reason McDonald's is called a restaurant I, I don't even know how that works but yeah it should be good to stay in uh we dragon rage don't know if that'll do much but let's get it done so yeah Roselia Got him out of there. Feebass is flying for some reason because uh, the fish can fly. Must be the one fish from Zelda. Link's Awakening. Which is coming to the Switch, by the way. I'm actually kind of hyped for that because um, man, I've just always really liked 2D Zelda. Like, Link Between Worlds is a phenomenal game. If you haven't played it, definitely go pick it up. You gotta have a 3DS, though. Collect your gene, Allison. I don't care if I lose, I'm still a happy guy. Why, well, you're too much. Oh, well, we got a, a Waluigi in here now. The meal was delicious, and our battle was so much fun. I really insist that we split the bill. So I think we fought this couple. Or not couple, I'm pretty sure this is a kid, and that's a freaking... I don't know, his mom. Alright, let's see. Oh, you have to hand it to my father. Those... Uh, I don't know, ores d'over are delicious. Well, you may be asking me for a battle. Well, certainly, I never back down from a challenge. I don't know how to voice a rich dude. Roman? What are you trying to copy after Professor Rowan? My personal favorite professor out of all Pokemon? Oh, he definitely is my favorite professor, like... Every other professor is pretty cool. I actually say like the new professors are really cool, but they got nothing on Rowan. He just seems like he's he was born to be a professor. Like Oak's definitely cool. He's OG, but Rowan's just got that stern look or whatever you call it. I don't think that's even the right word. He just has that look where it's like, yeah, this guy... This guy has been working in the field for a while, but Oak over here looks kind of young. Kind of like a noob. <laughs> I don't know, that's not even the right term. I'm just not doing the right terms today, dude. I don't even know what I'm saying. Splatfest starts in less than an hour, so I'm trying to get this video done. Splatfest that's starting is... um. Knights vs. Wizards, and I'm hoping, hoping Team Wizard wins, although I do have my doubts because M Pearl has won the, or never mind, uh, Marina has won the past three Splatfests, and Wizards is being rep by, or Marina is being rep by Wizards, vice versa, I don't know, so I, f I don't think any of the uh, Squid, or not Squid Sisters, Off the Hook has gotten, uh, what do you call it? Uh, four in a row, so either it breaks that chain of having the max streak being three, or it'll go like usual and Pearl will win. And I will have lost every Splatfest uh, with the first loss starting with the stupid Smash Bros. Splatfest. Like back then I did not like Smash Bros, but Smash Bros has grown on me. It's a pretty cool game. Definitely played a lot. Never thought I'd lose at Papa's restaurant. Oh, how could I lose it to your Papa's restaurant? Uh, Papa owns this? Okay. Finally, now we can go about enjoying our meal without disruption. Alright, we'll talk to this lady. I have to slow down on eating these delicious for the better. I don't know how you say that. I don't want it to be all bloated by this time the main dish comes. I like a light battle to work up my appetite. Yeah. Oh, I probably should have switched Gyarados out. What am I doing? Ismail? Hey, Ismail! And then we got Harley Quinn. Apparently. 
So Gyarados might be a little over leveled after this, but he might just sit in the back of the party for a while. Uh, let's try bite. Double bite, maybe. Let's get it. Double bite. Man, I remember back in my original platinum uh like playthrough. I, I just swept absolutely everything with my Torterra. Like it was level one hundred. Had everything going for it. I even had Crunch on it, which was a really good move, but for some reason I got rid of Crunch. And, uh, yeah. Biggest regret of the game. By far. But we just saw Cricketune faint. Knock on one that doesn't happen to ours. Uh, I'm just gonna skip the dialogue, because I do not want to forget to, um... Swap Garrows out. Alright, I don't care about your foods. Cold, thanks for sharing. Alright, switch it up. It's the Nintendo Switch. We'll give Bubble Baby some screen time. Why not? And I just realized I'm gonna take the, uh. Um. Nah, that's not what I wanna do. Take the experience here. Hopefully I didn't interrupt you just a moment ago. I was thinking about just not saying anything, but... Wait, he doesn't have a tank. Uh, give... I was thinking about like, just not saying anything. But, um, nah, I don't know. You gotta apologize, dude. Not Canadian, though, so... Just so, in case anyone was wondering. Okay, oh, it's night. And so apparently we spent a whole day in there. Seven Stars Restaurant. Oh, that's what it's called. So, what do we got? I think this is the Game Freak House. So, I'm not going to check that out. Route 213. Got a Pokeball. PV up. Basically restores power points. And nothing else. So, Rock Climb, we don't add that. Oh, uh, we could check out these houses, but I don't really know what's in them. Maybe you hit an item? Ah, man. <laughs> I don't know. It just seems really obvious where hidden items are in this game, so. We got the cops, and then we got an ace train over there. So, yeah, next place. Next route. 213. What was this called? Hotel Grand Lake. Another world on Lake Valor. So, we got a yellow shard. Also, off screen, I did manage to pick up some more super potions. I think we're up to 11 now. And I did find a red shard somewhere. So, hee <laughs> hee, I can battle too. Good for you. Tuber Chelsea. Meryl. Oh, she had one of those things where when you throw the Pokeball out, it has an effect. Yes, I think so. I think that's what that was. But Slash is like power. Uh, I guess. I don't know. It was power before. I, was, I might have just been a Pokemon that was really underleveled. I wasn't paying attention to that, really. And by before, I mean last episode, so make sure you go check that out. Tuber Chelsea. Losing made me all hungry now. Okay, cool. Is that your brother to run along beside the shore? That's not what I meant to do. We gotta go to Pokemon. So, item take. And I'll just give it to, um... Thank you. So yeah, I'll give lemonade up here. What's over here? Anything? Nope. Just this dude. Hey. Okay. Isn't this nice? I love my inflatable tube. Yeah, inflatable tubes are actually pretty cool. I remember going down some like lazy rivers. Rivers, rivers, lazy rivers. Oh man, it's just a sign that I am tired, but I gotta maintain enough energy to play the Splatfest. Apparently, the um, Shifty Station got leaked. I heard, but uh, I'm not gonna check it out because that's just gonna ruin the surprise. And we're getting pretty lucky here, because um, water. Ground, I think. Shows just might be normal water. 
And I know that Shello, or Shellos or Gastrodon, I think it might be Shellos, that's Pokemon number 400, actually, never mind what I'm saying. I think it's Pokemon 422. I only know that because that 422 is my birthday, let's see here. Keep battling. Which one's this going to be? Pink one. Oh, pretty easy. Sweeped. No level up though. But that's alright, Jared. It's not easy trying to move holding on this level too. Yeah, get back in the water, you frick. Okay. Yeah. So we got a fisherman. Just battling. Oh, never mind. No battle. Here's a fancy hotel and a fancy place with the fancy restaurant. The fancy restaurants feel with fancy people who think of themselves as being too fancy to battle alone. Sure do love the or the word fancy. Is there anything here? Like items or is it just going to be like a Jew dude? Let's try breaking them all. Huh. wonder if there's even a point to this. I don't know. I'm just curious. Like, it seems like a Geodude or something would come out of him. I think that's how it works for, like, the Orbwork Mine? I'm not sure. It looks like that was pointless. Any items? Nope. Oh, here we go. A battle. Wow, no, just now. I was just about to roll it in. I feel like that's a line from every Pokemon game. I think I definitely do remember that from Crystal. Which I have played on the 3DS Virtual Console. Really wish they'd bring over the uh, Pokemon Virtual Console games to Switch. Or oh, wait, I just realized there's no Virtual Console on Switch. Instead, we have Switch Online, which is fine. Uh, so why am I even... Yeah, I'm not even going to complain about it. Like, it's honestly a cool, cool thing they did. I'm not going to hop on the bandwagon of hating it. I personally like it. It's pretty cool. The background actually looks pretty cool on this. I rarely record this late at night, so you get to see the cool nighttime background. More often than not, I'm recording like early in the morning or something. Like I just recorded the past few videos, like previous episode of Platinum I just did, and then a couple of Bowser's Inside Story videos. Oh man, here we go. We got a showy. Why? We'll just get some Gyarados v Gyarados action on, on here. Yeah, this is good stuff. Okay, here we go. Gyarados or Gyarados? Um, I just bite the dude. Okay, that didn't do anything. Hey, he, he's literally like a ditto. He's just copying. Alright, that was a little better. Dude, look at this boy. I'm gonna heal just to be on the safe side of things. Before this guy heals. Are you gonna heal? Ah, oh, nah. Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage is 40, so should be good. Yeah, there we go, we're good. Oh, way All the way level 30. X Scissor. Alright, let's see here. X Scissor. User slash set the foe by crossing its scythes or claws as if they were a pair of scissors. 80 damage. So, 10. 20. Actually, wait, Fury Cutter. Used in succession. I don't know, we're just gonna get rid of Fury Cutter. <laughs> well, a lot of experience. Fisherman Kenneth, you need to have more respect for a grown up. Well, maybe you shouldn't be fishing at a place where young kids can literally just run up and scare away your Pokemon. So yeah, uh, what is this? Oh, I remember this footprint or something. Yeah, footprint reveal. I don't know what the point of this is, but we'll go check it out. 
Pokemon are quite easy for me to read. I need only to see their footprints and their innermost thoughts are revealed to me. Oh, you are skeptical of my claim? Then let your grotto walk in front of me right here. From its footprints, I'll determine how it feels about you. Oh, back up. As I, if I said there can be friendship between Pokemon and people, will Grotto's friends understand? But if you see Gabriel and Lemonhead, you will understand because Gabriel and Lemonhead are friends. And that is what your Grotto thinks of you. I must say, your Grotto and you share a very close bond. This is for you. Footprint ribbon, let's get it. Oh yeah, I remember having this. Let's just check it out real quick or I'll show it off. Probably do that with all our Pokemon, but I think our Pokemon saw is Pokey Russ. Where would it be at? There we go. Look, we got a foot ribbon. So, uh, yeah. Let's head on. Let's see. Oh, battle. Let me demonstrate my technique. It's how this grown-up battles. That's a grown-up? Well, I mean, it is the chibi style, so it's kind of hard to tell. Cindy. I thought if you swapped the D and the N, it would have been Sydney. But it is not. Okay, Fisher Glam Meow is normal, but we'll just go for the Razor Leaf. Oh, there is my attack, but who cares? Special attack move. Let's get it, my dude. As a kid, I probably would have understood none of like type well not types uh so, like special attack attack all that stuff i just spam the same move that did the most damage and that's all that mattered didn't overcomplicate the game at all like some people do today and i kind of do I don't know. oh my gosh you attacked that savagely but yeah i just use the same move twice yeah Let's heal up Gyarados. Uh, super potion. Yeah, as you can see, I got some more. Healed up pretty good. Yeah, everybody's level 30 now. Alright, Rock Smash that thing into oblivion. Oh, I just saw Honey Tree. Get out of here. Like, Honey Trees are cool and all, but I don't want to take the... Oh. Oh, oh, get it, get, get it quick. I already break the rock. He's gonna look. Get it. Alright, we got it. Aerial Ace Boat. Wait. Feels like Togetic would be able to learn that. Let's check it. Where is it at? Aerial Ace. Maybe one of. Oh, yeah, I was right. But all these dudes can learn it. But it seems like Peach would be fitting for the move, so I'm just going to go for it. Which move should be forgotten? So we got Rock Smash, Wish. Yawn. I don't think Wish would be good. We got potions and whatnot. So, get rid of that. <laughs> and it's not even that good of a healing move. Self-heal move. There's something on top of the big cliff here. My instincts tell me, but how am I supposed to climb up? Well, you got to um, get rock climb, obviously. Something that I did not know when first playing through this, because, you know, blind playthrough. What do you expect? Just like my Bowser's Inside Story Let's Play. I'm probably missing out on, like, everything in the whole game, but... Oh, wait. I don't have an encounter for this place. So let's grab these berries... And then I'll run around the grass, try and get some. Rost. Uh, is Rost the burn heal? Not sure. I don't know. I only know like Cherry Orin. The basic ones. What they do. A uh, Papa Berry. Interesting name. There you go. There's your interesting name of the day. So yeah, I think that's it for the route, but let's see what our encounter is. Shellos. Oh wait, we already had a Shellos? Okay, so. That's our... <coughs> <coughs> so that's our first one. So, um, 
get up to three chances. That's the rule I'm going by for this. If we don't, if we get all repeats, um, then we just don't get anything. Weasel we haven't had yet, so let's try and get a weasel. Okay, Lemonhead can't go for grass type. Let's go for bite. Please don't pursuit. Please don't do much. Okay, that was fine. So now I start chucking pokeballs at this dude. He's got an inner tube around his neck. I always thought Weasel was pretty cool. Remember, like Ash had one in the anime. Then he gave it to Don. I think that's what happened. Not sure. Sorry if that was a spoiler. But yeah, we're going to go randomize the nicknames now, so be ready. Alright, personally, I think this is like the most fitting name besides Lemonhead we have. So basically, it's uh, Ruddy, which is like, one of the owners of SKB. He just seems like he'd be a weasel if he were a Pokemon. He just seems like the type. So yeah. Uh, let's see here. Story Cities. This, oh, okay. I actually don't remember. Oh, okay, never mind. Scratch that. I remember a lot about Pastoria. This place is great. So now what? Team Galactic's here. Oh, I'll always love this. I would like sit there for a long time as a kid because that, that is just a cool thing. Like it, it was definitely like you know just kind of a, a little thing to throw in, but it was just cool. And then there's like the uh, safari zone in this place. And I'm not sure if we could take on the gym already. If we can, then uh, might go ahead and hop in there. So let's see here. Story City Pokemon Gym Leader Crash or Wake. The, the Torrential Mass Master. So I think we can. Oh wait, here comes Barry. Alright, get rid I mean, sorry, not Barry. Roadkill. Whoops. Yeah, we're always gonna plow into you every time we meet. So how's it going? We're buffing out your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon to see how buff and tough you are. All right, we got a battle. Wasn't expecting this. So I forgot about it. <laughs> Roadkill, Staravia. Oh, not. Oh, thirty-four. Okay, timeout. Uh, this is gonna. This is gonna be something. Level 34. Please tell me that's your highest level Pokemon, because we are not ready for this. Okay, my mind, please, my dude. Please come through. My mind. Double team. Okay, he he's raising evasiveness. Uh just gonna trust bite. Okay, we're missing. Don't you freaking dare, dude. No. Wait, come on. Okay, bite. Oh. Oh, my boy. My mind coming in with the flinch in the... Good job, my mind. You a pro. Look at all that. Weasel. He's got one, too. I'll just go with Lemonhead. Hey, at least mine's got a... Nickname unlike your freaking no name weasel. But I can't be making fun of him. I never nickname my Pokemon normal playthroughs. Pursuit. That wasn't bad. How much? One shot? Let's get it. <coughs> uh, Monferno. Okay, definitely have to switch. Do we have anything to take care of? Uh, and check everyone's moves. Anyone good against fire? Oh, wait, he's fire. Fire fighting, I think. I'm gonna trust my gut there. Ink stinks. Ink stinks, not ink stinks, or whatever I said. Okay, please, Mr. Peach. I'm trusting you. Please. Flame wheel. No, okay, I was a little bit. Super effective. Okay, please, Peach. Flame will, please. Okay. And we're gonna have to heal. No healing wish. Wish I just took that off. So let's see. We can just use. Just gonna do normal super potion. <laughs> so 
So please go flame wheel again. No crit, no crit. Why did I say that? Why did I say that? Oh my goodness. I jinxed it. But um We're still hanging in there. Thank you, Peach, for being a tough boy. Alright. Mark punch. Okay. Should be fine. Please finish him off. Please. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, that was a threat. Level 36. I didn't even realize that. My grotto would have been a Torterra by then, I'm pretty sure. Rosalia. Okay, Rosalia. Um. Huh. I think it. Wait, I'm thinking of Rose Raid. And Roselia. I'm just gonna go my mine. Come on, my mine. I trust you. I'm just gonna go Dragon Rage on this thing. Probably take a few turns, but. Yeah, Intimidate. Oh, that's even better. She might go for special. Or he might go for special moves. Alright, that was half. Magical Leaf. Alright, that was nothing. We got her. Got him. Diff keep thinking Roselli is a girl, but that's a dude apparently. My mind. I can't XP. What just happened? You told me I lost? Yes. That's what happened. Hey, yeah. Maybe you can get a little bit tougher since last time. They even shot me a bit. So yeah, because I was careless. Oh yeah, I joined Mr. Wake as an apprentice. Like, I want my own theme song. And... Astoria Gym. So, um, let me just check in here real quick. Okay, I think we could take the place on. So, um, yeah, and I, uh, that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, next time we will be, um, taking on the gym. Starting with the, um, first getting to the gym leader. We'll be taking on the, uh, trainers in there. And then after that, I'll do off screen training to get all trained up because if crashers like crasher wakes pokemon or like road kills just gonna be tough so anyways that's gonna be it i'm gonna go play some splat fest in a little bit uh make sure you go join discord server down below go into the giveaway down below check out other videos and other series on the channel and that's gonna be it thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos see ya peace